Non-conference girls basketball action Tuesday afternoon at Tower Hills Weaver Gymnasium, one of the best old gyms in the state, as the Hiller girls played host to the charge school of Wilmington. Both teams coming into the game with state tournament aspiration. First quarter action, Sophie Ayers is going to find Hannah Graveline on the right wing. Graveline is going to get to the lane, get the left to go, plus the foul. Tower led 3-2 at this point. Tower is down 7-5, and Tessa Mullins knocks down 3 point here to give the Hillers an 8-7 lead. Charter would take control at the end of the first quarter here. Katie Cole is going to miss the long shot. Abel Ostrowski gets the rebound and layup. Charter led 9-8 after 1. Second quarter action now. Veronica Sanchez Wright is going to go into the corner. Find Tamia Burley coming towards the middle. Gets the bank shot through here. Part of a 9 point night for her. And Halene Zhang off the offensive boards. Finds Danielle Kanze open for two of her 9 first half points. Charter led 20-14 at the half. Third quarter action for Kanze. Going to find Sanchez Wright on the right wing for two. Charter led 31-27 after three. But Tower Hill would make a rally on Senior guard Caitlin Smith goes in for layup here. This pulls the Hillers within two points. Game tied at 32 now with about two minutes left. Smith gets the tough bank shot to go. Part of a 13-point night for her. Tower Hill led 34-32. Game tied at 34 now. Sanchez right finds Conze going backdoor for two of her 13. It's a short two-point lead right now. Game tied at 36 when Smith misses the free throw and off of the loose ball. Abel Ostrowski is eventually going to get fouled. She makes the free throw here to give Charter 37-36 leads. Excuse me, with nine seconds left. Hiller's coming down the court. Mullins passes off, gets the ball back. Time is running out. Mastrowski comes up with a steal, and Charter escapes. 37-36. The win. Yeah, I mean, this is a big win for them. We had a seven-point lead, I think, max, and then it got down to the wire. And, you know, uh, Kate Smith for them hit that bucket to tie it. So for them to hit that free throw to give us the one point and then go down and defend those last nine seconds is exactly what you want in February. I mean, it's really good feeling for the team, especially because we just went through a, um, a string of, like, tough losses on the day. So it was really nice to get a win, even nicer to get a close, meaningful win. And, I mean, it was nice to have a win on their senior night. Yeah, just talk. It means a lot. We've been... From Tower Hill, Chris Stevens, First Day Hoops Report.